literally the one secret for market validation is that you will be i think this is one of the common challenges that i have faced when i was like how can i get market validation second how can my product get market validation third one how whatever it is whatever i'm saying is it making sense to you and this is i think one of the greatest challenges when we become an entrepreneur when we are creating products when we are creating services when we ha- when when we can have that when we when we have that idea that okay, this needs to be executed we come across this one challenge like okay is it going to make sense in other words is market going to accept what i'm going to what i'm doing third is market how can i validate this one particular thing that i do so in this particular video we are going to dive deep into the secret the one secret to market validation and i'm fazer if you don't know uh, this is fazer over this side i just help uh, introvert entrepreneurs who wants to create who wants to go from idea to execution from this challenge from the community that we have the community's name is the academy of artists scientists where we have all introverts in one bucket where we do a lot of cool stuff build business stuff like that now having said that now diving deep into this thing i want to share this screen and kind of walk you through a wide board sort of a thing so that you get a better perspective of what i'm saying and it will also help me derive a lot of things hang on if you are looking at the screen right now the graph that's like the graph cool now in this particular graph that's where we all are i am there you are there the whole world is there now can i can derive this particular graph with a small little example for example i just take my examples like i graduated as an accountant i graduated as an accountant but when i went for uh, interviews and stuff like that i was on the red side and what the people were expecting me was this one thing like the expectations were here and i was here cool now if someone back in the day would have helped me cross this bridge now this is the bridge that we're going to talk about b r i d g e cool the bridge that we're going to talk about anything that you're doing it's called this that particular graph is called the solution graph TSG just so that just so that you can fit in the solution graph. So that particular graph, that particular gap is where you are going to step in, where I have stepped in. So if someone is here in entrepreneurship, how can I take them to this particular thing? The, the gap in between is going to be your calls, is going to be your sales webinars, is going to be your products, is going to be your services, is going to be your bonuses that you do, is going to be your one to ones. that graph that gap is literally where your business will be taking place you can do anything and how do you get validated is yes you don't even have to go to the market you are doing research from your end first you don't need to go like thousand steps and then get validated the first step in itself is like a validation for you first you have to be aligned with what you're doing first common tactical strategies the super power that you want how do you validate the superpower is through this particular graphs like how am i going to take the person from point a let's go back to the graph from point a a different color how can i take a person who is on point number a all the way to point number b got it that's all you're going to do from point a to point b and you just have to prioritize things you keep that like you need this first this second this third this fourth based on the priority basis you do this so, so the first thing you do is you research you go to youtube you go to google you learn stuff you you get you can skill yourself on what's actually required in the market because there's always a demand the supply is also there but if there's like huge supply you can kind of take the small part of the whole dominate you can you can just pick a small piece of the whole internet and own the space within the market if the supply is not there or if you see okay this particular domain needs my voice you go ahead and have your voice add your voice to the table your unique voice to the table and based on that voice you're going to dominate with your own perspective that's how you talk the first you do research now that you're congruent with the research and stuff like that how do you get validated you just have to think you don't even have to go anywhere you just have to think about it is what i'm going to shoot today create today script today make a presentation today create a product today going for a conversation is 
whatever i'm doing da 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 whatever whatever that can be if whatever i'm doing is taking them from point a to point b if the answer is yes answer is 95% yes all the time 5% will be based on your lack of strategy the lack of effort it falls under these two categories so 95% the answer is going to be yes great validation done go create the product sell trigger use the trigger points use the psychological triggers and make the purchase make the sale that is supposed to happen for example if the answer is no like if if i'm not taking a person if if the answer to the question is from point a to point b are they am i making sense are they going to benefit out of this if the answer is no to that particular question then you know exactly what you have to do you have to take the content either rework on it from scratch or think twice of what you are actually building maybe put a goal to that particular piece of content or the script or the presentation what's the end result reverse engineer it re-script it out then ask the same question is now what I'm going to teach is taking them from point A to point B the answer is 95% again yes that brings us to the conclusion of this particular video thank you so much for watching this particular video and I will see you in another video Yeah.